Okay, and before we go continue, I just want kind of want to show something. We just check something. Okay, yeah, like those five are to get ten are together. What do and yeah, no, eight those eight are together. Yeah, just want to figure that show it off for the heck of it. Uh, but, but now we're back to heading to the subspace bomb factory. And we'll join back up with P Pikachu and Samus. Now this level can be very short or very long. Pretty short if you skip all the collectibles. Or, like, I think it's the shortest level in the game. Um, or alongside that fight with that boss fight that was supposed to be in that Kirby game, but never got released. Because, like, if you go, like, the correct way... I mean, skip all these, like, collectibles here. You know, you could be done with this level in, like, two minutes. But I'm gonna go for, all, for them all. Well, actually, I'll, maybe not all of them, but I'll go for a couple. For the wind. Playing this Pikachu here, which... Because I can, and not Samus. Who knows if we will or not. And... Something I didn't mention about Zero Suit Samus' Final Smash, which I actually didn't know about. Uh, uh, forgot, or forgot about was that when the old two Samus turns back into Samus with the final smashes, it actually sucks peop the, the play people win into way. Yeah, it actually sucks them in to well. To well. Uh, as Samus is getting back back into as the old two Samus is getting back into the armor. So, yeah, something I forgot to mention, Jin, which I actually forgot, did not, forgot about that thing, Go, which I actually had to look up to know what Zelda's final smash was, which, because I actually didn't, don't, didn't even remember, but I somehow did, but yeah, I look it up and we could choose that level two, that 211, hell, hit. Hey, but hey, maybe this is, maybe this is, this is maybe this Pikachu was actually the Ryan Reynolds Pika, uh, Pikachu that was voiced by Ryan Reynolds in Detective Pikachu. Who, wait, yeah, we can act funny. He had one on to you, but yeah, yeah, kind of funny if that is, even though this was like over a decade before Detective Pikachu. This was like in 2000, yeah, this was 2008. In early 2008, actually, I think in was it January or February? I don't remember, but it was one of those two months. Months and and yeah, yeah. And Detective Pikachu came out in May of 2019. <laughs> so, not to mention that Ryan Reynolds' upcoming movie, The Croods Two: A New Age, which. It, I'm surprised that movie got a sequel. Well, oh, okay, yeah, that was the correct one. One, so. Oh, so I'm not going into that door down below. We'll save that door for last. Yeah, so. Yeah, so we could, yeah. But Coons getting a sequel? I never thought that would happen. Like, I've only seen the first Coons once. I died for that because the camera didn't catch up. Wait, hold on. Where am I? Okay. Trying to get my own street. Wait, so. Oh boy, this room um, here. How will we get out? Simple. Just press the switch and it activates the door. And. Oh boy, these things again! And with. with so I'm my. I don't know. Wow. A good man, damage there. Ooh, that does. I done it. Yeah, see, like, you're slowly doing damage when it's uh, not open it up its cockpit. It just does very slow damage. Oh. Okay, up here. And jump back into the door. <laughs> oh yeah, but yeah, back up saying before. I didn't think the coons would ever get a sequel, which. When we saw the first Croons once, which was back in like in theaters, which which came, that movie came out in two thousand thirteen. 
interesting, which, yeah. And I know the movie's on Netflix, and I've seen it once, and uh, maybe I'll watch it again since the new one's coming out uh, uh, this month, Thanksgiving, actually. <laughs> which it's only like a few weeks away. Oh boy. Uh, I don't think I can get that one. Oh, wait. Ah, darn it, I went over to the wall. Okay, on I'm gonna get this now. There we go. I thought I needed, was gonna need Pikachu to get that. Uh, that, because his up special was a little better, but uh, the wall jumps do, did it, which, it's not it's something you can do, ooh, ooh, but I don't do, you can't do it with every character. I know with Mario, you can't do it. But then, I think that's also how you get the up that one area that I did with Pit in that, the planes. But, yeah, I just uh, didn't do it because Pit was just easier. Let's see, wait. Nope, not this one. It was one more. Oh, it's a... Uh, You can also tell that this is the correct area to go to because look, the, the music hasn't changed from one and you can see the lights all of a sudden. I don't think I'll make this jump now while holding the hammer. Well, well okay, maybe I could have. Oh, wow, <laughs> how fitting. Thank God that I did not. Oh, you're coming with me. <laughs> Well, thank God that I didn't get to shrink down. Oh, hammer again! Oh, God. Die. And... No, 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 no! Darn it. It won't let me sprint. Oh, that's okay. And, yeah, that stage is over, so... I could've... If I wanted to, I could have just head straight for it and would have been done in like two minutes. But I chose to just go out the collectibles. The ancient minister, which not on his hovercraft. I think it's looking all down for some reason. I went off to get everything in. Bomb factory again. This time with. These characters because that platform that they were on it docked in. <laughs> it's you don't. Uh, so. <laughs> yeah, I remember this stage being kind of long, but yeah, like there was the, like the platform that they were on that docked in, which took a long time for it to do. And you think there would be a cutscene for this one leading up to this one, one not just a tran cut straight into this. This, this, but nope. Oh, it, it didn't, did not do that at all. Oh, oh, unfortunate. That's not a, it's not a, really a big deal. Do you really? And, <laughs> because all that matters is just if the stage is good or not. It, fucking, <laughs> that was Rob's or someone. Then, uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Thank God for that. That's so. Uh, uh, more of these, come on. I'm tired of. Uh, I don't like these Rob launchers, okay? So, what they are. Okay, that one turned into a trophy. And I'm gonna grab it this time so that I don't lose it. Or it despawns. And. I will take the okay. I'll take the those vibes over the launcher vibes, up because they don't have homing missiles and and yeah. <clears throat> and now the stage is an auto scroll way. Only for only temporarily. Door to go in. Let's see what it has. Has uh, anything good? Oh, wow. Tomatoes with M's. That could have helped. Helped if I didn't die with Captain Falcon. And, but, eh, I guess it's okay. 
<laughs> oh, now they're changing up with some spike platforms in. And but I almost made it through without getting hit by it. Um, thank God the state. Between, thank God it stopped scrolling over here. Yeah, which is thankful for most scrollers. I think, or maybe all, I don't remember. Well, all auto all scrollers, well, <laughs> where they would just uh, stop whenever you reach the edge of the screen. Oh, by the way, new type gimmick here. Where the store here, it has li lights on it where you have to, to actually get off. Uh, you have to find these switches like that and, and yeah, and they will, well, as you can see, light up once you come up to them. Um, so, oh, they, it's not a gimmick that's used too often, but yeah, it's there and it might be used one other time or two, one or two more times. Um, so, yeah, well, it's not a good, Kind of a semi late game gimmick, but say that, that we're not like too close to the end of the game. Who, who? This could really help. Switch is here, and there's a door up there, but I don't think we'll be able to get up there. Oh, thank God. Uh, uh, I managed to recover quite nicely from that. Now, the last switch is over here. Here, so. Let's get it and. Get the heck out of here before we die again. And, ooh, I need that. Because <laughs> uh, pretty much you need any food really to get my percentage down. And now the door's through and we can, oh, all the lights are there on, so we can go through the door now. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, I think that if you, you can find a, a switch that, something that deactivates these for so temporarily. Yeah, there is. Right here. Or, oh, guess not. Yeah, well, that doesn't really help. Help well. Maybe it will help for killing enemies, but yeah. Yeah, so. Okay, this is one I was thinking of. Of, of right here. Ah, uh, crud, I messed that up. Why am I trying this? I uh, really... Camera? It wouldn't... The camera wouldn't catch up. <laughs> it usually does. But, ah, uh, oh well. It's not... Ah, uh, how? Let's just... Let's just get moving on. On and... Yeah, the... Okay, that's point here. The idea is that you're supposed to activate that switch so that... Those things will turn off so you can get through. Or even though you can't make it through without. Oh, right. Out of pigmen. Wow. I didn't realize how useless armor is. Yeah. So let's just throw some pigmen out. To attack. Oh. Luckily, the room will you know, not you just get squished all the way. And, you know, and close all the way. It kind of bolt. It's kind of stupid how that enemy will not die, die for getting squished. Because in reality, it would. And but anyway, we have a key hidden here. Here and come out key. Of course, it's the last one because it's always there. Move you giant Voltorb enemy. Wow, they launched me right in the door. And there was a crack there with Donkey Kong just fast as his fist wheel. Like. Get in the door. Bobs, use the bombs. Wait. No, don't use bombs wisely. Not all at once. Wait, should we? Right, they're not under my control. Now they are. It's like, no, don't. <laughs> bombs, attack. It's also kind of funny thinking about because those are bombs. They're all bombs and 
Ancient minister is, well, something else. Well, it will make sense in a second, Dio. Yeah, because he wants to, again, he wants to use all those bombs at once. Oh, I like this part here coming up. <laughs> I don't know why, I love that shot of get Captain Falcon lifting the bomb. He's like, Duh! no, I don't want this. Good. Out of all the ways he used to stop the bombs, that's really the most effective way. He was a Rob the whole time. In fact, he was the original Rob the whole time. And Teddy can't I'm just look at him like, whoa, look. And so, plays him and... Pikachu. Captain Falcon. Yeah, yeah, same as. <laughs> so, uh, got Rob, which is a new character. And I don't know, like, too much about this character, but... But interestingly enough, Rob was actually a playable character in Mario Kart DS, which is interesting, and I think it's the only Mario game he's playable in. <laughs> well, that's, and yeah, uh, there might be some other games he's playable in, aside from Smash Bros, because he is in Smash for Wii, maybe, well, he's in, I know he's in Smash Ultimate, mid, and, yeah, <laughs> da, da, and then, well, there we go. I like how you can see all the vibes in the background there with the bombs, but they're not even opened up. And which is kind of funny. He, he, he's a, have this enemy attack to fight. Oh no. No, so. Hammer again. How often have we seen, it's the first time we've seen it so far. There is one other hammer that we haven't got to see yet, which it's kind of like this, but a little different. Aha! Fan time! <laughs> that again! Wow! How often does that happen? And well, well, we get a, a mushroom, a mega mushroom, and a mini mushroom. Which I know they're not really the mega mushroom and mini mushroom, but I'm just calling them that because it's the uh, my magic wand will magic you away. Oh boy, that one will help. That M um, will help. Darn it! I tried grabbing it, but I somehow slide walled. Ooh. Grab that. There we go. I did not mean to grab the potato. Uh, pota I said potato. Wow. I'm losing it here. Oh man. Worst part is you have to fight two of these at the, la the last two of them. Are, of these, you have to fight a. Uh, and these are uh, fight of these. Ah, oh, don't I didn't even get a chance to attack it. I, thank God these guys are not too annoying to uh, oh, annoying. Well, in, in terms of... I can't move. I can't move. Okay. There we go. It was because I was stuck in between them. Oh, boy. Am I actually going to get a game over on just because of these two? No, that would be kind of annoying. Jump! Okay, there we go. I got one. One more, and I'll be safe. Hey. Yes! Just made it through. And my reward is a tomato. And yeah, the bombs are all just in the background, just standing still, but the cutscene is all open now. And there's like a ton around. It's a little barge open because for some reason they're just locked in place. And I guess this is the original Robin trying to mind control them to stop. It's no use. And we're stuck. I failed you. Come on, we gotta get out of here. <laughs> no. Captain Falcon is Batman, let's go! So we gotta play him again, and let's do Diddy Did Kong and Donkey Kong and Omar. Alright, so now we're escaping, but because, well, yeah, it all of a sudden becomes an auto school, we're right there. So now we have to escape before this place blows up. But really, the, oh yeah, if the bombs were going off. 
You already saw all the bombs going off before we saw like Rob actually being uh, ancient minister become Rob. Uh, boy, it was Rob the whole time, but just in a outfit that made him look like that. And come on, let me get through. Okay, there we go. Oh, oh fucking three. It's okay, there we go. Oh, but yeah, it's all kind of confusing. Mm. I'm hitting, but oh yeah, and Rob's final smash is he'll get like these laser eyes that can shoot slightly full ahead, of, ahead of him, and that and whoever's in front of him will get attacked by him. And I'm not sure if you can charge up gi giant blast attacks with it, but or not. But yeah, if, this play, if those bombs were going off, like before Rob became ancient minister, became Rob, uh, well, uh, those platforms will be go up if you stand on them. Um, and, uh, and yeah, that those jets think will come down here, but they won't actually stop. They will stop right before the door, so you're safe there. And yeah, those bombs were uh, a lot. We'll activate it right like, before that en enemy fight. Right, well, well, if that is, then we we'll have like one minute to kill all those enemies there, and another minute to. You make you get away to the ship, ship because Captain Falcon has a ship with us. Because how else did he get here? It, it's like the only reason explained on how one of them gets here. Oh yeah, really? Yeah. We, yeah. Never mind. Mind and and you have a one more minute to make you get away. Wait, so just get out of here and oh. And, Hearts, that would help, but it's yeah. Now we're free falling. <laughs> click click. Yeah, yeah. This is the ship, and and this is the best part of the stage, really, because Ridley is back. Except that it's a, there was a twist to it. It's Metal Wiggly, <laughs> Ridley. <laughs> so, so, we have two Samus and Pikachu, and yeah, Rob and Captain Falcon. So now we have to attack Metal Ridley here, which this fight has less health than the original Ridley. But yeah, I love this, I think this fight's better because the fact you're on the ship here and you can actually do stuff to the ship, like smack it down to where it goes off screen for like a second. Can do stuff like that, and you also want a, on a time limit here with two minutes, uh, because yeah, and because uh, that's how that works. And uh, okay, he's good. He did not did not die, but like this. Okay, it, it sort of worked, and. Pikachu does do a lot of damage, a good amount of damage on this, so Pikachu is probably the best person to fight the boss here, and he does get eventually new moves that he does, the more damage you do, you do to him. Um, like, he'll grab onto the back of the ship and slowly anchor it down. Down, and... Yeah, look how much damage that did. And so... Uh, Oh, it's still fun. Keep doing that, and yep, this is it. He grabs onto the bottom of the ship and slowly drags it down. But I somehow managed to kill him fast enough before he would drag it off the screen. Oh, um, okay, no. It was the only one where we like oh, smack it like completely down from like the middle. No, but yeah, I don't think we'll see it. And time's almost up. Oh, yep. This, okay, yep. That was it. That, that's what I was saying. And you're, you're also slightly moving, if you can't tell. Uh, oh, and... Oh my god. Cutting it very close, here. you? Okay, one more hit. 11 seconds left. Wow. If, I, if it was a minute and 50 seconds, I would have had one second left, and that would have been crazy. <laughs> uh, we managed to make it escape that thing in time. And who would have thought? A bunch of bombs together would make one giant one. That almost sucked up the ocean. And 
and a lot of stickers you and only one trophy would have gotten more but i missed a couple bob's now joined the team and save save right here here here's the oh yeah and yeah now we got a giant and bomb there up there when the whole island's gone and which means there's more room for the midnight ship to fly hey even now we have entrance to subspace but we're gonna save that for next time for next episode so next time on super smash brothers wall we will go go to the go through the entrance to subspace so see you all next time